Hey, what's going on? We're going to talk to you a little bit about light and how we know what the stars are made of. And we're going to use the element neon to do it. So um, this thing right here, this thing is a spectroscope. It's got a little film on one side that you look through. And on the other side, it's got a little slit that you can let light in right there, that little slit there. And then it's got a film that lets the light through there. And that film is a diffraction grating. It's kind of a prism. So if we put this up to the camera, like we would put it up to our eye. There we go. Look at that, it's beautiful. You're actually getting like, really kind of just, these fluorescent lights don't give us a continuous spectrum of light. They give us like one purple, one blue, one green, one yellow, one red. And then when all that gets in your eye, you see white light. Okay, so what if we didn't get white light? Like what if we had another light source? Well, over here, we have this tube that's just filled with pure hydrogen gas. And hydrogen gas is explosive, but it's safely contained inside this glass tube. And if we turn it on, we're gonna run electricity through it. Hopefully it won't explode. Oh, good, it didn't explode. Okay, that's good. But it makes this really beautiful purple color, like Mace Windu's lightsaber. Now, if we take our little spectroscope and we hold it up to there. Oh, oh what was that? There we go. Nice little bands of a green, a blue, see on the right, and a red. And we're also getting some of the white light from the room, so it'd be even better if this were totally dark. And that's hydrogen, the most simplest of all the elements. Okay, so mostly reds and blues and a green, and that's where we get the purple. Let's take a look at another element. This one is neon. And this is where we get our neon signs. They're pretty much like made Las Vegas. Boom. Pure neon element 10. It's gonna give us this beautiful red light, but it's not really red. It's mostly reds. A lot of reds, yellows, and oranges, but there's some green and blue in there. Big gap between the green and the yellow, and the reds are definitely most bright. There's some green in there. And when we look at the stars, we see the, the light that's coming off of them with these things. We can split that up and we see that um, there's a lot of hydrogen in those stars. So a lot of that hydrogen in there. All right, y'all. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Now you know stuff about light. <laughs> Have a good day. Bye-bye.